Hello everyone and welcome to the talk. I'm Aaron Scott. On this episode, Connie sat down with Lori Etheridge and Cassie Richardson to get the lowdown on the Artistic Civic Theater's production of Pump Boys and Dionettes. Plus, Eric Roberts is back to discuss the current status of his daughter's disappearance 18 months ago. Then we'll talk about Dalton Ghost Tour's upcoming Full Moon Ghost Walks, this August 7th Haunted House Workshop with Connie, Richard Rulin, Jennifer Spear, and Bob Hanica at BE Creative Center in Dalton. And we'll tell you about how you can get four free tickets to Copper Creek's Farm Sunflower Festival. And we'll be right back. The Pump Boys sell high octane fuel on Hobby 57 in the Grand Ole Opry country. Dinettes run the Double Cup Dinner next door. Together, they fashion an evening of country western songs that received rating reviews on and off Broadway. With heartbreak and hilarity, the Pump Boys and the Dinettes celebrate the value of friendship and life's simple pleasures. Earlier this week, Connie sat down with Axe, Cassie Richardson, and Lori Etheridge. Watch this. Well, welcome, Lori and Cassie. It's so good to have you both on. Thank, Thank you. you. And I'm so excited about ACT's first production post-COVID, and that is once again going to be Pump Boys and Dinettes. Mm -hmm. Yes. And yes. you ladies are the Dinettes. Yes. We are. <laughs> <laughs> so how is everything going? How, what's it like being back in the theater? Oh, it's great. I mean, we started this production um, over a year ago. It was last March. 2020, we were ready to go. The show was about to open. I think we were two weeks, two weeks yes. away. Oh, and wow. the set was complete, almost, and yeah. costumes, everything, and we got shut down. So it's just kind of been on hold. So we're mm -hmm. very excited to be back. Do you have the same cast? Yes. Oh, that's do. wonderful. It was, mm -hmm. a, it was tricky. We had to kind of reset the dates and make sure everybody had yes. an open calendar. So that was a little tricky, but but we nailed it down and we're ready and we're excited. But it's gonna be so yes, much fun. Yes, yes, yes. Um, so tell me a little bit, if you will, Lori, about your character. Okay, my character is Retta Cup and she is the sister to Prudy Cup. <laughs> and um, the girls own a dinette and we run the dinette right next to the pump boys to mm -hmm. the gas station <laughs> and we just hang out cook a lot of pies and sing <laughs> wonderful <laughs> do y'all actually eat pie on the set we don't mm. but we have but the guys do oh wonderful. Yes. Yeah. well that's yeah. a bonus yes <laughs> <laughs> and so cassie what about your character what so i'm of? i'm prudy cup mm -hmm. so i'm Reda's sister and and this really what Lori said there's not a real underlying, I think, story with our characters. Mm -hmm. It's just a lot of really fun music, oh. hanging out at the diner, mm -hmm. a lot kind of flirty, yeah. flirtatious with the boys, and just fun. Mm -hmm. yeah. It does sound fun. What are some of the songs you do? Uh, some of the songs we do together, we have one called The Menu Song, mm -hmm. which is a really fun one. My favorite is one called Tips, Tips. where we sing about getting tips from, from our customers. <laughs> what else? Um, our opening number is one of my favorites. It's Highway 57. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Which is where it's located, and we all sing on that. Everybody's so talented in this cast. We have such talented musicians, and a lot of them, you'll see them switch around and play different things. Mm -hmm. Just a very talented group, so it's That's a fun. so much fun. Yeah. What's your favorite song and your favorite number? I think I think I'm gonna stick with tips. I, I oh like, yeah, of course. Yeah, that's just that a fun. Yeah, yeah, that's just a fun one that she and I get to mm -hmm. yeah. do together, and mm -hmm. we, we're gonna go out into the audience, and mm -hmm. maybe we'll get some real some maybe. real tips. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> so you might fun. find some talent yeah. too. You may have someone out there maybe. singing along. Maybe. Yes. Pull up next time. Yes. Maybe. So your both of your names have been in the local community theater for a while. Mm -hmm. What are, I mean, I guess what draws you to that? Either, both of you, whoever wants to go first. Um, I've been doing local theater for many years. And I think what draws me the most is, well, you know, a love of just being on stage and performing, number one, but also just the camaraderie and being with friends and you become like a family mm -hmm. when you get to hang out and just make music together. And we're just all great friends and it's, it's like a little community. I think it's fun too because you're if if you like to perform mm -hmm. and you like to sing and you like to be on stage, you're with like-minded people, mm -hmm. and so right. so like for us to have missed a year, we all kind of know how that feels as performers. So that's mm -hmm. it is very much a community. So sure. that's what draws me to it. 
What is your favorite production you've ever done? If that's a oh, fair question. Oh my goodness. You probably don't have oh, one. I have wow. one. Mine is Ring of Fire. Oh, yeah. And we actually were in that that's one, one of mine as well. too. That's one of mine too. Mm -hmm. Johnny Cash. Oh, mm -hmm. I wish I had saw All that. All Johnny yeah, Cash music. Fun. We're gonna bring it we're back. We're gonna bring it back. Oh please. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And if you do, I hope you'll do a number or someone will do a number here. I yes, mm -hmm. it's Love it's it. fantastic. That was yeah. my top. Pick. I've got a lot of favorites, but um, that would definitely and Smoke on the Mountain is one of my favorites. It's very popular, isn't um, yes, it? Yes, we've done that several times. It, we've done it over so many years that I played the daughter at first, and I've played the mother more recently, so that's, <laughs> yeah. That's a lot of fun. Um, so what are some of the other things coming up at ACT? I hope Ring of Fire. We know, don't know about that. I, but I do we, know Clue is coming. Mm -hmm. Is that that's the fall? I guess the Halloween yes. slot. Oh, yes, and that's I know be great. Um, the director. She's already sent out some things asking for people to to come help, and um, right. I think she's announced audition. So I know Clue. I don't know. I can't remember. I know there's a children's production coming up, but I'm not. Totally Lion sure. King mm -hmm. is Lion King. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's right. a kid's one. Right. So mm -hmm. that sounds good. So everyone who wants to come out to see Pump Boys and Dinettes, what do they do? You well, can go online mm -hmm. and get mm -hmm. tickets online. That's the easiest way to do it. And you can choose your seat. Oh, um, great. You can mm -hmm. choose your seat and go ahead and pay in advance. If you do happen to just decide that night you want to come see the show, I'm sure that you'll be able to walk up and get tickets as well. Okay. And so by the time this airs, you will have already done one weekend performance. And we have, uh, or you guys are offering the opportunity for this upcoming Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Mm -hmm. yes. It's going to be fun. I'm literally going to get my tickets when we're finished up here to make Wonderful. sure that I don't miss it. Yes. I'm so excited Good. to get back into, into the theater. Yes, we are too. <laughs> and I've been prowling online and seeing some of your photographs and um, you've somebody has posted a little bit of the singing that's going on at rehearsal right. mm -hmm. and it's truly going to be a fun event so um, yes. I will see you guys soon and I hope that you guys will come out and enjoy this production with Lori and Cassie yes thank you for having us thank, thank you. you so much <laughs> for coming and the rest of you will be right back